Okay, today we'll be looking at the MicroGuard MGL5753 oil filter. And you can get this at O'Reilly Auto Parts for $4.99. So let's get started. Okay, let's open the box and see what she looks like. And in Mexico, maximum efficiency. And I believe these are made by Wix. You have eight inlet holes. You can see a bypass valve. Metal core with louvers. And let's see, the O-ring, I'm sure this is a nitro O-ring. It's on fairly good. Looks like it's got these little indentations for it. So it's on there nice. Let's see, you got about four threads there, I see. And what's the date code? Yeah. 052520 AR2 217132. So that looks like May 25th last year, 20th, 2020. Okay, let's open this baby up and see what she looks like inside. Okay, here she is cut open. Let's get the weight of her. She weighs 7.1 ounces. And we'll do the base plate too. 3.2 ounces. It's a nice base plate. The o rings on here is pretty good, so this is good. You know, this is only a $4, not, well, $5 filter. So, I don't expect too much out of it, but so far it looks pretty good. You know, this, I don't know if this is silicone. It feels like rubber, but it's, I mean, you can really, uh, yeah, I kind of, I think it's rubber. I think, it, I think it's a rubber, nitro rubber. I don't think it's silicone, but it kind of feels like silicone, but it's, it's got a little bit of a stiffness to it. So, I would say it's, uh, it's a rubber. But filter media here you got metal end caps you bypass valve down here and I counted uh, 45 pleats metal crimp seam and they're just nicely spaced not bad they're not, you know you don't have no excess glue really or anything it's pretty clean Let's get the, well, you know what? Get a coil spring, too. Nice coil spring. Keeps it all nice and tight. In the can. Point 0.3. Yeah, I was getting about point 0.3, point 0.4. Yeah, it's about point 0.3, point 0.4. Well made can. Okay, we'll get the width of the filter. 1.65 inches. Yeah, 2.31 inches. 2.19 inches. And uh, this is supposed to be a 95% at 29 microns so that's what your filtration is and it's supposed to hold 13 grams of dirt and it's a cellulose fiber media I want to show you like at why these coil springs are so nice Let's see how nice and tight it is 
Come on, get it in there. <laughs> All right, there it goes. Yeah, nice. Got a nice spring to it, so it holds everything nice and tight in there. Just like it should be. Can't do that with a stamped, one of those stamped leaf springs. Well, you know what? Let's cut this open and see how long she is. Okay, here she is stretched out. It's a short filter. It's only 38 and a half inches long. Okay, well here's your filter media. It's um, it feels like your typical filter media for you know this price range of a filter. For a five dollar filter, they they all pretty much feel like this. It's like a cellulose, probably a cellulose blend. Sometimes they call them enhanced cellulose, or whatever I don't know, but they all pretty much look and feel the same in this price range. Uh, the best feature of this oil filter is probably the coil spring. I mean, this is well made, um, very strong. I can't. I, I was trying to pull it apart just to look at the bypass valve, but it's it's glued together very well. Or they glue. I think they glue them in there tight fitted somehow. So yeah, this is this is all very strong construction here. And, you know, like I said, this is probably rubber. Nice can. It's only a $5 filter, so that's what you get for 5 bucks. Overall, it looks like a pretty good filter. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be afraid to use this filter. It's nice. Well, I think I'll wrap this video up. Don't forget Oil Filter Friday. I open up a new automotive oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please give me a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching and take care.